You're very welcome. I think I'd be a little scared. I'm friends with his son and I know he told me he used to like to cook and he used to like make chili. So um, that was one of his favorite things. So I guess I'd try and find a very good recipe for like chili con carne and, uh, and, and hope for the best, you know. There's a lot of tracks I've listened to more than a hundred times, but uh, I think one that I can never listen to too much is uh, What's Going On by Marvin Gaye. That's, that's an album you can listen to, you know, when you feel good, uh, you can listen to it. When you feel, you know, maybe a bit sad, you can listen to it. It's always an amazing piece of work, so uh, that would be my choice. Ce serait uh, un rêve de faire une improvisation avec uh, avec Stevie Wonder, or Prince, maybe, peut-être, Prince, or les deux ensemble. <laughs> you know, I'd always love to have played the saxophone, I think. I can't play it at all, so, so that's, that's the one instrument I think. It's one of my favorites in jazz. Uh, maybe like by the pyramids, I think it would be maybe a place that's, you know, very atmospheric and uh, a good energy there. So I think uh, that would be somewhere it would be fun to, to do a concert, you know. Leather jeans or leather pants, you know, so I don't know. I don't, I'm not sure if I could really pull it off. Jim Morrison or somebody or maybe Miles Davis, you know, in the, in, in the early 70s. For me, the le, le Chanson de Morse et, uh, et uh, My One and Only Love. And the version by, by Johnny Hartman is, uh, is very, very romantic. So it's, uh, it's probably one of the most romantic songs, I think, for, for me, in my opinion. I hope that was enough. It's okay. It's okay.